time to put up some plastic sheeting because we're going to do a Dexter inspired craft. everybody, I'm Amy. Welcome to my channel. Thanks for joining me for a Dexter inspired craft. Today we're going to make blood slide coasters and a sample box to keep them in. You can find links for all the materials you will need for this project in the description below the video, both on YouTube and at craftymcfangirl.com. You will need six rectangular clear glass tiles. 24 clear sticky plastic bump-ons, red transparent glass stain, a cigar box or unfinished wooden box, brown paints, a paintbrush, and a gloss sealant like Mod Podge. Start by turning your tile over to the back side. Stick the plastic bump-ons on the four corners of the tile. Then flip the tile over to the front and squeeze out a circle of transparent red glass stain. Make sure that the stain is spread out quite thin, then set it aside to dry. Repeat the process five more times to create a set of six coasters. Set your glass tile somewhere safe to dry completely. This will take several hours. In fact, I would wait a few days before using the coasters to really give the glass stain a chance to set and become permanent. The next step is to paint the box to look like the slide box that Dexter used. I started with a cigar box, so I needed to cover up the writing on the outside and make it look a little bit darker brown. If you are starting with an unfinished wood box, you will need to paint the entire box inside and out to make it the nice warm brown tone from the show. Once the paint is completely dry, the final step is to seal the paint and add a glossy finish. Give your box one or two coats of a sealant, like Mod Podge. Once the sealant is completely dry, put the blood slide coasters inside, and your project is done. This would make a great gift for any Dexter fan. Just make sure that they keep the incriminating evidence well hidden. Thanks for crafting with me today, guys. I hope you have fun with your coasters. And if you liked this project and you want to see what's coming next, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Thanks, and I'll see you next time.